What is up you guys, Digital Next, and today we are doing things that only happen once in a lifetime. Because you know a moment like this, some people wait a lifetime. So let's go ahead and jump right in. Someone found the beginning of a rainbow. Now I don't know if this only happens once in a lifetime, but how many times have you been like, oh, I found where a rainbow originated from. I've seen it for all its true colors, and they are not so bright. How many of you actually think there's something at the end of a rainbow or at the beginning of a rainbow? Who knows? There might be someone there waiting for you for an important quest or something. When the sky looks like that, up is down and down is up. I don't know what's going on here, but those those are some perfectly wavy, wavy clouds. That would confuse me. I'd probably trip. Where am I going? Which way is north? I've been going west my entire life. You got this spider over here making these intricate web designs. Look at him. This should be in a museum. What spider got time to do all this? My dude trying to, he, shouldn't he be trying to capture like flies or something or some type of bug so he can eat and feed his family? He over here working on his art career. And you should have seen his other design and said that's some pig, you know? He helped this pig out earlier, but uh, that didn't go so well. <gasps> oh, God. Jenga. Are you supposed to yell Jenga when you fail or when do you yell Jenga? That's very nice. Long hair? I like long hair. I feel like that hair gets dirty. Like her hair is so dirty sometimes because it just drags on everything. Don't you get your hair caught? Like what if you got your hair caught? What if there was some jerk who put gum in your hair? Then what? Oh Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your hair. I don't like this. This displeases me a lot. I don't know how this was made, but don't do it again. I'm glad it's once in a lifetime because I don't like it. You ever look at something or someone and just be like, you bother me. <laughs> I don't like you. Something about your presence disgusts me. Ah, that's where the speakers are. I had no idea where the speakers were. No way that's what's behind a movie theater like screen. Why would they put the speakers back there? I mean, I guess it would, wouldn't, this, is the sound gonna go? I don't know, that's weird. I thought they always threw them on the side so that way you can hear the characters or whatever run around or what. I don't know, but that's pretty interesting nonetheless. If you look at this perfectly timed photo, if you look at the water, it looks like a face of a happy elephant. I don't know if you knew that. Mantax, zoom in, zoom in right here. Enhance. Enhance even further. If you guys are wondering when I say, hey Mantax, can you do this? Mantax is my editor that I have helping me edit videos. He's actually really nice and he's he's pretty good about being on me about making videos. So if you wanna know why I've been putting out more videos kind of frequently, it's thanks to Mantax. So Mantax, go ahead and show your YouTube and show your Twitter, show whatever links you want on the screen right now. And that's it, only for like 0.5 seconds. If they're there, if they're there any longer, I'll know. I'm gonna look at this video afterwards. I better not see them there for even a second. Only 0.5 seconds. Hello, my name is Vantex. I'm the one who edits videos for digital. My YouTube username is right here. My Twitter username is right over there. And I hope you can gonna tell digital it's longer than 0 0.5 seconds, okay? And that's it. It's the shout out you got. <laughs> to the elephant in the room, literally. Not talking about myself, but the one on the screen right now. There's a face of an elephant in that water. He's happy, the elephant getting washed is happy. And I'm happy, because I, I love animals and I think all animals need to be taken care of. Who got time to do this? I wish someone would try to trick shot near me. I'd smack that ball out of here. No, 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 not on my watch. Get it out of here. Apparently these are actual dinosaur footprints that have been embedded in the earth and they've been left there. Someone preserved them. I don't know if that's real or not. I'm I mean, those are some pretty big footsteps. Someone could have made them, but that'd be cool. We all know dinosaurs are real and they existed a very long time ago. And if those are actual footprints, then that's even cooler. Wouldn't you want to just put your foot next to it and see how big it is? It was raining and this sheep started growing grass. How? How does that happen? My dude gonna become his own garden. If you ever wondered how those, like, how some gardens have animals as their poses, that's, that's what happened. The animal eventually turned into that because they just started growing grass out of them. The more you know, right? This is what a horse and a pony look like. That is a small pony that's not a pony that's just a miniature horse that's little Sebastian <laughs> little Sebastian what are you doing that's me and my girlfriend if we if we were ever turned into horses <laughs> that's the size comparison oh my <laughs> oh my god that's hilarious that's so perfect that's like me standing next to sniper as well <laughs> You okay, done there, friend? Take, 
I take quick photo, you look fine. Get that fixed by doctor, you know? I don't know why I made him Russian. He just seems Russian. A real life dragonfly landed on this lady's foot that happens to have a tattoo of a dragonfly. You know, maybe the tattoo comes to life when she's not paying attention. Is anyone else disturbed by how big dragonflies are? Those things are disgustingly huge. Have you ever been hit by a dragonfly? I have. Those things fly around so fast, they kind of just don't know where they're going. They smack right into my face one time. Needless to say, me and that dragonfly still have beef to this day. How many times do you see the bird that you're reading about lands right next to lands he's like hey look at that that's me <laughs> chirp chirp <laughs> oh yeah that's what it says about me that fact's not true you need to go tell them to rewrite this dude my name's steve what's up how's it going you got any worms on you you got <laughs> you got any bread huh you got games on your phone what's up these are albino deers if you don't know what albino is albino is like when an animal is all white sometimes they have red eyes sometimes they don't it's just anything that's just all white that those animals look cool you know they have albino alligators they got i for some reason drew a blink on any other animal in the animal kingdom but i'm sure there's an albino version of it it's basically like finding a shiny pokemon it's not the correct color but it's a color that's pretty cool see now that's pretty cool how many times can you say you've done that that's that's a hard one you know getting lightning to to work on command i wonder how long he was standing out there for him like please i just want to Cool photo, come on, man! Lightning, I summon you, and then boom, it works. Coincidence, I think not. That's kind of interesting, I like that. That's I like when things happen to end up like that. It's pretty cool. It's spooky, like there's a theory out there. Hmm. Someone pulled this carrot out of the ground and its friend was hugging it so that way they'd be together forever. Now they get to be in my stew together forever. Hold me, carrot, I'm scared. It's okay, carrot, I'm here for you. Four people are wearing the exact same shirt. Apparently y'all have the same taste and fashion, which is pretty good. It's a lot of minds thinking alike. I don't know why he looks so disappointed. I thought this was a striped shirt meetup. What's up? <laughs> That's gotta be some perfect timing. Look, look at that, that thing. You gotta, you gotta go in and out, in and out, man. You gotta know my rotation. You gotta know what I'm thinking before I'm even thinking it. You gotta dance to the beat of my heart. All right, we gotta be perfectly in sync. Bye, bye, bye. Look at these adorable puppies, man. One has one dot, two has two dots, and the third one has three dots. There were three puppies, three dots. No one better be talking about my girl Taylor Swift. I don't know about you, but I'm I'm feeling 27, and th that's pretty high. I, I'd rather go back to feeling 22. Do you think they both looked at each other and they knew what trucks they were driving? And they were both listening to Taylor Swift at the same time? I don't know. It's nice to think about, you know? Maybe some two lonely truck drivers is listening to some T-Swizzle. When Onion Senpai smiles at you, before you throw him in the fryer. Oh, onion senpai. You're gonna taste so delicious. Thank you for this giant onion ring I'm about to make out of you. Itadakimasu. <laughs> all these people, ooh, 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 man, man, just, ooh, they, they moving so casually. Look, look how good they're all moving together. That's how you, that's how you're supposed to dance on sync. Something about their dancing is hypnotic. If I was reading this butterfly pamphlet and I was like, wow, man, there's a lot of pretty butterflies out here and one landed, I would look, I'd be like, there's a bug on me. Anyway, back to my pamphlet about butterflies. <laughs> have you ever been to one of those museums or like zoos where they have like a butterfly exhibit where like you just go in and butterflies are flying everywhere and they kind of land and you're like, oh, get, get off of me. That's why I'm not allowed back. I'm kidding. I, I love all animals, all right? Except rats and mice and guinea pigs and disgusting things like that. This is how happy this dog was the first time he saw snow. That's a pretty happy dog. <laughs> Why he look like a cartoon? Why you, why you built like that, weirdo? <laughs> why is he so happy? Is this snow? All right, you guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video there. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you thought about the video in the comments section down below. And to subscribe if you aren't already subscribed. And if you are, make sure to hit that like button as well. Turn on that little bell for notifications so you know when I go live or I post a new video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you all in the next video. Bye, you guys.